Now, are you missing your Strictly fix? Well, fear not, the show kicks off its tour next week and among those hitting the dance floor will be my next guests. Please welcome 2023 Strictly finalists, Bobby Brazier and Diane Buswell. Uh, five, six, go! <laughs> again oh you see it just comes naturally no well, I don't know about that. <laughs> do you know it was October that we were all sitting here and you were very early days and strictly that was the last time we were all here and here we are now I mean look how far you've come the final yeah. and now the tour it's been yeah. it has been it's a remarkable been real. it's been a real journey <laughs> It's been fantastic. And Diane, you said it even then. I mean, you were trying to find your ways, weren't you, at that stage? Because you're you're competitive. You want to yeah. win. And you knew he had it in him. I did. I knew from day one that he had so much to give, so much potential. And I'm just so proud of him. He made it all the way to the final. He learned to dance. He had the best time doing it. Yeah. There's nothing more I could ask No for. way. And you were brilliant, Bobby, yeah. honestly. We did. We all loved the, the both of you. Did you have time to recharge the batteries over Christmas at all then? Was there a little bit of sort of non-strictly time? Yeah, well, yeah. Did. But there was a lot of dancing still, because I, <laughs> lo I love to dance. We went to Mauritius and we did a salsa class. Oh I got my dad involved, my stepmom involved. That's brilliant because it is—it's a fitness thing as well as anything else. But it is a genuine enjoyment from oh, your point you of say view, isn't it? Fitness thing—I've got no kind of fitness. Well, the last time I saw you, you, t you told me you were eating ice cream for breakfast yeah. every day. Is that still happening? Or uh, pulling back now? It's post Christmas. Less so much. I did have an ice cream the other day for breakfast. I'm with you. But... I'm all over that. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, <laughs> that's gonna stop now. I know. We've said no sugar because all we ate was rubbish. Yeah, on we the did show. eat a we... lot of chocolate. Yeah, we did. Just to get us through the days. <laughs> it's the energy burst you need, I yeah. understand. And you went back home, of course, Diane. I yes. did. It was so lovely being home with family. Joe came with me. We got some sunshine. Oh. Yeah, it was dreamy. And your dad's Very doing nice. OK. I know you've spoken about your dad and everything yeah. else right now. And he's dad's been through a bit doing of a well. time, but he's, he's doing well. He's doing well, yeah. He's a legend, He is a legend. He is a legend. It's so good that you got to go back. Because know, now, lovely. once the tour kicks off, as you know, it just takes over again, doesn't yes. it? Yes. It does, yeah. So what, I mean, it's a massive tour. They throw everything at this. This isn't a half-hearted attempt. This is a proper arena tour. Yeah, I mean, Strictly is going into arenas. I mean, Strictly is massive anyway, but to dance it in these, you know, iconic arenas is incredible. I'm just so excited for Bobby to experience it. Obviously, I've been lucky enough to do this before, but... The, the real excitement for me is going to be seeing Bobby's face dancing in front of all these people. Yeah. So it's going to be great. I'm so and, excited, you know. And to get a chance to pick up the glitter ball. Finally, yeah. Bobby. This yeah. could happen yeah. now. Possibly. Yeah. This, why not? Why not? I why mean, not? There's a different right. feel to the tour, isn't there? Because, of course, there's pressure because there's real people in front of you there. So you yeah. do have to almost perform bigger. Yeah, you do. You have to sort of project. There's people all the way up in the top row, so you do have to project a little bit more. But I think he's going to be fine. The more people, the better, I think. That's what I'm most excited about. That just dancing in front of thousands and thousands of people at night, I think that's going to be a real buzz. You and like these a are rock star. Exactly. Yeah. And yeah. people and fans that have watched the whole series, so they're wanting you to perform. So yeah. there's a real connection, I think, between the audience on a tour like this. The judges are back, of course, then. And they Jeanette are. is hosting. Jeanette, Jeanette is hosting. Yeah. Yes, we had a day of rehearsal with Jeanette yesterday. It was so nice to see her. And she's, she's going to be doing a little bit of dancing as well, which is, yes. which is very nice. I've never Jeanette seen her back. dance before. And I saw for the first time yesterday, I was like, wow. Yeah, you have not got going on about Jeanette, how good she was. And she's so little as well. <laughs> she's so smart. brilliant. She's so brilliant. Well, tell me about the, uh, the jar of goodness because this this became a bit of a thing during the the actual Strictly program. Yeah. If, tell us about what it is because it, it, it was a fan that gave you this. Jar, yeah. Wasn't it? it was a lovely little gift from a fan. Um, a little jar that has all these beautiful sayings in it and. Every Saturday, uh, when we were probably feeling the most pressure, I would say, because you were quite nervous to go out and perform, and we would get a little um, saying out every Saturday and just and read it and, yeah, take it on board. Just a little positive sort of... A little sort of... positive affirmation, yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, we need a new 
jar, don't we? I know we do. We need a two-word jar so we can hand them out to everyone. Maybe we can write our own. Oh, that's a good idea, oh, Bobby. Mate, you can, you, you Little warm and fuzzy. Put uh -huh. them all in a jar and we can all pick one out yeah, before you can the write show. One for us. I, oh, I'm very good. Yeah, no problem. Leave <laughs> yeah. it to me. I'll do that for you. Absolutely. <laughs> we um, the last time we spoke as well, Bobby, you. you you love dancing so much, you just couldn't imagine it not being in your life. Mm. Not necessarily daily, but you need it quite often. And yeah. the musical theatre approach was such a natural potential job for you now. Would you genuinely think about that? I would. I think that would be really, really, really fun to, to perform in front of an audience every night and um, dance and, and, and act at the same time to just merge those two worlds together. I think I'd really enjoy it. Mm. But it's also a little bit scary. Of course, and you mightn't have her alongside you. That's yeah. the top oh, thing. I know, I know. <laughs> exactly. What performance are you looking forward to the most during the tour? Oh, I mean, there's so many performances because we've obviously got um, pro numbers, we've got celebrity and pro numbers, and then we have our individual numbers. I think for me, um, I'm really looking forward to well, both of our dancers, really. Me yeah. too, for different We're, reasons. Yeah, yeah they one's are, they, a party and one is just so it beautiful. Means so much, that, it? Yeah. Well, Strictly fans can see you all 19th of January. It kicks off. Thank you so much. You Thank, too. You. Thank, Thank you so, so much. To see you there.